what size concrete footing for 6x6 post. If you're planning to build a deck or a post frame building and you're wondering what size concrete footing you need for a 6x6 post, you're in the right place. Let's break down the details to ensure your project is sturdy and meets the necessary building codes. First, the size and depth of the footing depend on several factors, including your location, soil composition, and the load the post will carry. For deck footings, the American Wood Council's Prescriptive Residential Wood Deck Construction Guide is a great resource. It suggests that footings should be at least 12 inches below undisturbed earth or below the frost line to prevent damage from freezing temperatures. For a 6x6 post, a common footing size is a 16 inch by 16 inch square footing. In a 10 by 10 deck example, these footings are typically seven inches deep. However, this can vary based on the specific load and soil conditions. For instance, if you live in an area with heavy snow loads or unstable soil, you may need larger or deeper footings. To calculate the footing size more precisely, you need to consider the load on the footing and the load carrying capacity of the soil. A simple formula can help. A equals BC, where A is the surface area of the footing, B is the load on the footing in pounds, and C is the load carrying capacity of the soil in pounds per square foot. For example, if the load on the footing is 4,000 pounds and the soil can carry 3,000 pounds per square foot, the minimum surface area of the footing would be about 1.33 square feet. This could translate to a 16 inch diameter footing or a larger square footing. In terms of specific requirements, the footing must bear on undisturbed earth and the deck post must be attached to the center of the concrete foundation using approved post anchors. For a six by six post, you can use a cylindrical footing with a minimum diameter of 18 inches or a square footing with a 16 inch by 16 inch base and a 12 inch diameter stem for the post. For post frame buildings, the approach is similar but can be more straightforward since each post is isolated and carries its own load. Here, you would calculate the load based on the building width, post spacing, and any additional loads like snow. For example, if you have a building that is 40 feet wide with posts spaced eight feet apart and a snow load of 20 pounds per square foot, you would calculate the total load and then determine the necessary footing size based on the soil's load carrying capacity. In summary, for a 6x6 post, you typically need a footing that is at least 16 inches, 16 inch in size and 12 inches deep. But this can vary based on your local building codes, soil conditions, and the specific loads involved. Always consult local building building codes and consider factors like frost lines and soil capacity to ensure your footings are strong enough to support your structure.